So I've said this before and I'll say it again. Right now, during this really shitty market, the best thing to do is to spend your time to collect airdrops. This is almost like the power-ups that you get in Super Mario. You just keep clicking and collecting these little power-ups, keep doing these little tasks. And at the end of the day, when the airdrops do drop and this project launches a massive token reward scheme, then you'll be the one who can flex on Twitter and be like, yo, I got $10,000 doing all this. And all you motherfuckers, you guys are missing out. But anyways, go later. But we, today we got a step-by-step -step guide on how to get the most out of the CK Sync airdrop. In fact, we actually made a video about this in the past. It's actually one of the most popular articles on boxmining.com and one of the our most popular videos. What we found was that there's more ways to get more out of this ecosystem. So we have Ron here. <laughs> He's been doing endless research on how to get the most out of the ZK Sync airdrop. So every step by step thing, he's been researching for weeks on this. So yeah, it's 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 good. All right. Okay, now we don't need him anymore. <laughs> and guys, we have a lot of airdrop videos on this channel. It's one of the, my main aims to get like airdrops up here so that you guys can know the best best ways to make money in this space. So we, um, there's a whole list of um, airdrop videos here if you want to watch it. But I'll definitely say right now, number one is layer zero. Number two right behind it is ZK Sync in terms of priority of what to get. So make sure you pay attention to this video and stay till the end because we have some mega tips to min max that at the end. Guys, let's get started. All right, before we dive into the steps, I want to clarify where we're at right now with the ZK Sync airdrop timeline because some of you asked if it is still too late to qualify. In fact, we are still very early right now because the founder of ZK Sync said that a token will be required once the network is sufficiently decentralized, and that would be around next year. And if you think about it, this is very similar to Arbitrum's timeline, right? Its mainnet was launched back in August 2021, and as more and more people started using Arbitrum, it took them nearly two years to launch a token, so we can expect the same for ZK Sync as well. And don't forget, the ZK Sync era mainnet was launched three months ago, and according to their roadmap, we still have many more phases to go through before we reach decentralization. And in that time, that's when the token airdrop will be launched. All right, now that you know we're still early, there is plenty of time to interact with the ZK Sync ecosystem. In our previous video, Michael covered the core dApps that you can use to qualify for the airdrop. Just a quick summary of it, first and foremost, you must bridge funds to the ZK Sync era mainnet. This is the most important step that the ZK Sync team will be looking at. You can use the native ZK Sync bridge, or if you're looking to save on gas fees, you can also use Orbiter Finance. Now, once you've bridged your funds, it's important to show ZK Sync that you've been regularly conducting transactions. And the best way to do that is to use the top DEXs by total value locked. You can swap tokens or provide liquidity at SyncSwap, Mute.io, and SpaceFi. If you want more details, you can always check out our video. Now, a lot has happened since then. Many new projects have deployed and some of these projects could also have their own token airdrop. This means you can potentially earn double airdrop rewards, which is insane. So without further ado, we'll show you three dApps that will have their own token airdrop on top of ZK Sync. First up is EasySwap. This is the second largest dApp by total value locked. It's a cross-chain DEX similar to SyncSwap. In our previous video, EasySwap was not even live and Mute.io was the second largest app. Now why EasySwap quickly rose in TVL is because the team announced to share 50% of their ZK Sync airdrop to the community as well as an airdrop of their native Easy token. And to get a slice of that airdrop pie, you will need to provide liquidity to the protocol, which explains why their TVL is so high. So head on over to the liquidity pools page and see which token pairs you want to open a position in. However, it's important to note that they assigned a recommended range which balances impermanent loss and returns. So if the value is infinite, it means they don't recommend you using that pool if you're looking to minimize risk. So go for four of these pools instead 
And if you want to play it super safe, go for either of these stablecoin pairs to minimize impermanent loss. But if you have a larger position and don't mind a little bit of impermanent loss, go for USDC Wrap ETH to earn more transaction fees. Second one is VeloCore. It's a DEX that has a lending market which allows users to access various DeFi services within the ZK Sync ecosystem. For VeloCore, they did a Pulp airdrop in April where you can claim VC tokens, which is their native ERC20 token. Now, this was for the very early OG members before the ZK Sync mainnet even launched. And if you missed it, don't worry because they have more airdrop rounds coming soon. Now for the ZK Sync token airdrop, it's standard stuff. You launch the VeloCore dApp on ZK Sync era and start swapping tokens and providing liquidity. And this would get you qualified for the airdrop because you're interacting with ZK Sync smart contracts by completing those transactions. On the other hand, for the VC token airdrop, there's a good chance that you can get them by interacting with the VeloCore V2 protocol on Linea, which is another big ZK EVM made by Consensus. Now, the V2 protocol will be live on the Linea testnet when the Linea Voyage Galaxy campaign begins their DeFi week, which could be this week or next week. While you're on it, try to complete all of the other Galaxy tasks so that you can also qualify for the Linea airdrop. And last on our list is Bungie, which is a bridge aggregator powered by Socket, which is a blockchain interoperability stack. Now, Bungie is very similar to Orbiter Finance because they have efficient gas mechanics. Because Orbiter hinted at launching a token, it's also very likely that Bungie will do their own token airdrop to attract more users. So head on over to Bungie Exchange and start bridging tokens from any EVM chain to ZK Sync era. Now, you can also check out their gas refuel option, which allows you to deposit native gas tokens on the source chain and receive equivalent gas on the destination chain. This is very good if you're looking to save gas fees. Personally, for me, I'm a huge fan of gas refund mechanics. That's why I've been using Orbiter Finance a lot. But with Bungie right now, the fact that you can get gas as well on the destination chain, that's gonna be a lot of money saved. So those are the three dApps that could allow you to earn double or even triple airdrop rewards. So at the end of the day, our approach to the ZK Sync airdrop is the same as we did for Arbitrum. So I cannot stress this enough. It's very important that you regularly interact with smart contracts because in the Arbitrum airdrop, those who conducted transactions consistently got more airdrop tokens than the ones who didn't. But if you don't have enough ETH in your wallet and you're really looking to save on gas fees, try to at least interact with one of the dApps once a week, all right? Go for the dApps that have gas refund options like SyncSwap, Orbiter Finance, Bungie. And if you keep doing it consistently throughout the year, then you have already ticked off the frequency criteria. And that concludes our guide for today. I hope you guys find it very helpful. If there are more updates with ZK Sync, we'll be sure to let you know so that you can make the most out of this ecosystem. I also want to thank Bybit for sponsoring this video. If you haven't signed up with Bybit already, sign up with our link down below and you'll automatically get 20 USDT in your derivatives account. If you have any questions, please let us know. We'll be very happy to help you. And check out our box mining article in case you want an even more in-depth detail on the ZK Sync airdrop. And if you're interested in other airdrops, we have a dedicated playlist just for airdrops and we'll be making more in the future so that you don't miss out on those money-making opportunities. Thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Airdrop Ron. Shana now!